How's it going everybody? Light of the world fireworks. So just got back from my annual conference with my church and we stopped at Rockport, Missouri, the Shelton that they had there and stopped at one other place too, but didn't buy much there. So we are going to go through what I picked up at Shelton. Uh, most of it is going to be firecrackers, but I found some really neat things with the crackers that I've been looking for for a while. I'll show you that as we get there, but first up are these Whistling Mad Hornet with Report. I thought they looked pretty cool, looked a little older, so I grabbed them. Got a gross of those Whistlers. And what else do we got? Kayla got a box of Mobster Whistlers, and it doesn't say it on the box, but if you open them up, they say... Uh, mobster whistler with color and report so i don't know if it has a different color i haven't demo i haven't tried them yet so be on the lookout for that we'll probably demo those and check them out uh, we'll go ahead and get these out of the way these are space flyers uh and older these came from shelton they are a little bit older not you know nothing crazy but they are un so i'm assuming sometime early mid 90s maybe something like that if you know, let me know. But anyway, I got those for five bucks. And what is in this bag here did not come from Shelton. It came from another store. So I just picked up a few things. These are Whiz Bang by Flashing Fireworks. And I got these. These are Crackling Strobe Pot from Canon brand fireworks, and I know you don't. I don't find much Canon stuff, and I've heard they don't make Canon anymore. I don't know. But I got five of those. Two of them were seventy-nine cents, and the other three were uh, ninety-nine cents. So I got five of those. So uh, look out for a demo on those real soon, guys. So there's that. Now to the firecrackers. So, uh, these are Mobster 4012s. These have the logos on them. I made sure. I know they have logos on them. And this has the SF number here. But, these are 4016s. And these do not have an SF number that I've seen anyway. And these are also the logos I made sure. And I got. So I got the 4012s and the 4016s. This is 49B and this is 49A. But these are both got the logos on the crackers. And I have one open and I'll show you if I can find it here when we get to it. Not everything's in the right place. But I found some 4016s of these. And I don't have one of these open to show you yet, but we'll probably do a brick opening soon. But the the ones that I kind of looked at at the store, the ends are a little bit different. So I'm curious as to see what the crackers look like on those. Uh, they almost look sawn. And I got another 4012. Another 4012. That's that bag. And this is another 4016 of the aliens so I'll move some of this back here so you can see the alien stuff so two of each of those I think I may have one more and up next is this is the first one that caught my eye and you got to really look when you go to Shelton but because this the, the Indian guy on there is different on a lot of them so you gotta kind of make sure you know what you're looking for but neither one of these have the SF number that I seen I don't know what these are gonna look like I'm pretty sure these are going to have the the stars and the colors on the crackers but I'm not sure about these so they're both 4012s but I'm not sure one is bigger than the other so we'll probably open them both eventually and find out here is another one of the mobsters I bought a bunch of those because I love the fact that they have the color on the cracker and so here's this one this one is open and I will show you I had to make sure so you could tell by the look of the package look how old that looks 
they just look like they're old. I'll go ahead and open one up for you guys. Here they are. Oh, one of them's naked, Taylor. <laughs> so there you have it, guys. You got blue and you got pink or red, whatever you want to call it. Clay bottoms, of course. But that's what I love. So when I can find these, I buy as many as I can because I just love to have them. Because anything is better than red, just a plain red cracker, in my opinion. And here's another one of the 12, 40 12s. And... Okay, so these next ones are kind of falling apart. And I guess I got a free label because I don't know where that come from. So I found these. These were falling apart. Uh, so I went ahead and picked it up. But I made sure these were the ones that had the uh, stars on them. At least I hope that they are. So we're going to open them anyway. So let's pull one out and take a peek. What do you think, guys? <laughs> yes, they are. So there's the pack on those. Bricks falling apart anyway. There's not really any point in not doing it. So look at here. We got all kinds of... We got a blue one, a green one, white ones, pink ones. <sighs> so you got a little variety of everything. So that's what I love them, guys. So I got a whole brick of these... For twelve seventy five, and like I said, it was falling apart, so no harm in opening it for at all. Move that out of the way. We're getting close here to the end, gang. Uh, got two packs of these. These are whistling chasers. Uh, it doesn't say Mad Hornet or nothing on them. I'm not sure. It just says with reports. So I got two packs of those. There's the other one of that. And I didn't even realize I bought these. Buzz. Buzz Trouble. I, just, I grabbed a couple to try them. And lastly, is something that is falling apart. Completely falling apart. Oh yeah, is a 4050 of the Combat Commandos that have the color on the crackers so there that is i seen it somewhere and i made sure yeah you can see okay. it yep you can see it through the wrappers there so it was 1875 you could tell they've raised it, how many times they've raised the price on these but it was mixed in with the other ones and i thought you know what i'm gonna take a look at that guy i like 40 50s anything above 50 strips i don't really mess with a whole lot uh sometimes i'll buy 100 strips and 400 200 300 strips uh but i don't buy them to collect i buy them to shoot or something so anyway so yeah so there those are and i tell you what guys if taylor's cool with it <laughs> we are going to go ahead and let's pull one out taylor and let's check it out maybe huh It's not like I'm saving the brick for anything, right? Mm -hmm. It's falling apart. Thanks for hanging out, guys. I know I'm geeking out on this stuff. This may not be your bag, but man, I love it. Let's just try this. Don't have a knife down here. That's what I should have did. There we got him. All right, so there it is. Looks a little bit different than the other yeah. ones. Here we go. Oh man, I'm so excited. Geeking out. So there they are, 4050 Combat Commandos. Got clay plugs on the end. Green down one side and red down the other. Got a little thing to hang them up with, don't they? Nope. Oh, yeah, it does, right there. Kind of. <laughs> not a very good one. So, 4050 Combat Commandos. I'd never seen those, not in that color. Uh, you know, you can find them all in the reds now. So, you got if you're going to look to a Shelton's and stuff to look, you've got to really look and know what you're looking for. Best thing to do, look for the ones without an SF number. Sometimes that'll work, not all the time. But, 
Uh, sometimes you just have to look for torn packages and kind of look and see which, if you can find them. A lot of times they're at the bottom. But Anyway, guys, that is my pickup. So we got all the aliens. We got five of the aliens there. And one of the 4050s, a 16, 8016 of the combat commandos. And then we got all these mobsters down there. Every single one of those are like this. Or they should be. So, uh, anything else, Taylor? I tell you what, if Taylor's Taylor, you cool for five more seconds? She's yawning. She's tired. She's had a rough day. She's been painting her room, guys. She painted it by herself. Proud of her. She did a great job. So, these are the 12s, 12s, and these are the 16s. Let's open the 16s. I want to see what they look like. These are 16s, and those are 12s. So, I only got, two, I got three 12s and two 16s. So, SF199, we're going to open them. I do not think these have the color stripes on them. I think they're all red. But we are going to open it up and check it out. Let's see what we got. Exclusive content right here, right? Mm -hmm. You have to be subscribed to get them. No. <laughs> Not really. No. Exclusive bricks. Oh, you know what? These yeah. do have the stripes on them. I wish I'd have bought more. Oh, man. It always happens. It does. It always happens. I was expecting. I now wonder what the other ones are because I looked at a brick of these and they were not barber pole colored. Let's check them out. There they are. Sure enough, guys. They're still out there. Surprisingly. Well, that makes me even more excited, but also less excited because I wanted some of the red ones. So I don't know what I'm going to get with them. So I tell you what, since we're doing it. We're here. We were going to open some anyway. Taylor, you want to open one of the 12s and check them out? I'll try. <laughs> so we're going to do one more exclusive brick opening, guys. So there they are. I didn't, I didn't, I could have swore they were going to be. Try not to rip the label there. I'll try. Yeah, rip it down the back. That'll work. I'm pretty sure these were all reds. They look like it. So these are all reds. What's the ends look like? Clay plugs on the end. Clay plugs mm -hmm. on the end. So, yep, I don't know, guys. It's falling apart. That one's falling apart. But so yeah, you could tell that as they get newer, the quality on them doesn't get as good. Well, if I would have known that, I would have bought more of the 16 packs. But I'm pretty sure they're all mixed in there, and because I did look at one of the 16s like this. And it had red crackers in it. And I thought, well, they're probably all that way. So I'll just get a couple. Well, I picked a good one. <laughs> right on. All right, guys. So that's going to be it. 13 minutes long so far. Thanks for watching Light of the World Fireworks. I know firecrackers are not everybody's thing. But they're my thing. And I know some of y'all love it. So I will probably be doing some brick openings of the uh, mobsters and the warpath in the near future. And doing demos and things on you know, the 50 strips for sure. So, Taylor, say something, nothing. Y'all see my messy basement down here. That's cool. But, all right, guys. Thanks for watching Light of the World Fireworks. It is greatly appreciated. Make sure you like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. All right, guys. God bless. We will see y'all next time.